Agusan del Sur is the fourth largest province in the country. The province through the Provincial Environment and Natural Resources Office, Local Government Unit, or PENRO LGU, is determined to achieve its objectives and sticks to its vision, vision and plans in order for the future generation, especially the young Aguzanans, to enjoy and benefit from a healthy environment. The Pentro LGU was created by virtue of SP Ordinance No. 14, Sears of 1994. The office operates under its mission, vision, and mandates. Vision Healthy environment and sustainable natural resources within the province of Abusan del Sur. Mission Protect and preserve the environment and natural resources through proper management and implementation of harmonized environmental policies, plans, programs and technologies with the collective involvement of communities and stakeholders within the devolved, shared and co-managed areas in the province. Mandates The Provincial Environment and Natural Resources Office under the Provincial Government of Agusan del Sur is responsible in the sustainable management and development of the environment and natural resources within the devolved and co-managed areas and ensures implementation of devolved functions, plans, programs and projects, as well as strategies for the protection, safeguarding, utilization and conservation of the natural resources. There were five divisions under Penro with specified corresponding functions. The Mines and Geoscience Management Division oversees and regulates mining operations, particularly small-scale mining in the province, enforces relevant local and national mining laws, and takes charge of permit, processing, and control. The Forest Management and Development Division implements and enforces forest conservation and protection, resource development policies, programs, and projects. The Biodiversity Management and Development Division implements and enforces biodiversity conservation and protection policies, programs, and projects. The Environmental Management and Regulatory Division implements and enforces waste management and pollution control policies, programs, and projects. The Research and Development Support Unit conducts research development, perform environmental awareness and institutional development, and act as Secretariat of the Agusan del Sur Environment and Sustainable Development Council. The Penro programs, projects, and activities are the following. The Forestry Development Program, the Biodiversity Conservation Program, the Responsible Mining Program, the Ecological Solid Waste Management Program, and the Social and Environmental Safeguards Program. Under the Forestry Development Program were these projects. Forest Tree Park Project 16 forest tree parks with a total of 18 hectares Three seedlings production and nursery maintenance project 150,000 seedlings were produced and disposed annually 100,000 falcata 30,000 mahogany and 20,000 assorted endemic species Provincial Government of Agusan del Sur Crini Project One provincial recreational tree park with 500 trees were maintained annually Small-scale Falcata timber production through agroforestry project With 1,589 enrollees from 2014 to 2017 and 1,692.5 hectares of timberland were developed Sustainable Small Watershed Management or SUSWAM project. 16 were locally declared a small scale covering 10,226.18 hectares of watershed area. 100 hectares were reforested as of 2017. On 
the Biodiversity Conservation Program. Rescue for Important Conservation Hotspots or the RICH Project. Rich areas consist of 20 lakes, 40 falls, and 13 caves. Bantay the now enforcement operation within declared local conservation area project. 145 Bantay the now volunteers institutionalized. Thirteen cases filed in violation of forestry and wildlife laws. Thirty-six kites used for bat hunting were confiscated. Two hundred forty-seven electro gadgets surrendered and confiscated. Developing capacities and seeking platforms of convergence mechanisms in the management outside Agusan Marsh Protected Area Project. Four local conservation area with a total of 23,364 hectares. Community Awareness on Resources and Environment or CARE. Three endemic tree species adopted. Creation and Institutionalization of Bantay Guwat Project. 15 Bantay Guwat Institutionalized. Under the Responsible Mining Program, Support to Centralized Mineral Processing Zone or CMPZ Project, 1.5 million were allotted to support in the construction of CMPZ. On revenue generation, 25 million were taxed annually from Felsaga, and around 3 million from quarry and sand and gravel extraction. Ecological Solid Waste Management or ESWM Program ESWM Communication and Engagement Project 13 municipalities and one component city provided with support to complete the 10-year ESWM Plan ESWM Capacity Project Regular Monitoring and IEC Campaigns to Municipalities or City 466 material recovery facility were operational and maintained. Under the Social and Environmental Safeguards Program, Environmental Social Fencing Project, Support and Promotion of Agusan Marsh Products such as the Indigenous Fruit Jam, Indigenous fruit cookies, the water high scent charcoal bricket, slippers and bags, support to assist DC, NRCs, and Enros project. Environment Code of 2007 served as guide for decision-making with regards to environment. 17 resolutions passed by the SSD Council in 2017 concerning environment. ENRM Profile and Database Project Systematic Computer Program as Database of the Department Environment and Natural Resources Profile of the Province Regularly Updated LGU works immensely in order to meet their goals for the benefits of the Agusanons and for the people of this province to experience a healthy environment. Its campaign in conserving the natural resources and preserving the environment might be a big task, but for Petro LGU, it is both working towards success for best outcome in their mandates and expressing great love for the welfare of the Agusanons by the means of educating the people of this province on how to triumph a more livable, habitable, and comfortable environment.
What is good for the natural resources will be good for us, as we ourselves are part of it.